Good morning. Hello, everyone. I wanted to do an update on the seeds that I took from the spaghetti squash that my daughter made while I was on vacation in Miami. And if you didn't see it, check out the video of how I saved the seeds from the spaghetti squash that she was cooking for our dinner. So I soaked them in water for a few days and then everything that sunk is the ones that I kept and then I put them on a paper towel and I let them dry out on a, uh, for a few days on her counter and then I packed them in my suitcase and brought them home. So I came home last Sunday and then I planted these in this little greenhouse that I got from Tractor Supply and I always keep these on hand so I have like three more left. So I should probably stock up on some more, especially when they go on clearance, it's good to buy them. So you just soak the water, the soil that's in there with warm water, and then they give you this little stick and you stir it around, and then I put the seed in there. So this is six days later, and I have the little sprouts coming up. And then you can see another one starting right there. So in a couple of days I'm not going to go much further I'm going to keep the little plastic greenhouse on here to see if I have anything else that makes it and this will be plenty because they'll get big so uh, this will be plenty for what I need I also uh, put some in the actual garden in the soil but I have not seen them sprout up yet so I do like this method better of putting them in a little greenhouse and letting them sit out here in the sun and I will probably put these in the ground maybe tomorrow because they can't go much further than the actual lid and once it starts touching you don't want it to do that so I'm probably gonna give it today and let them get some more Sun in this little greenhouse see what happens with this one and then I'll take these and put them in the ground and see what happens hopefully they turn out good but that's just from the seeds from uh, or a grocery store uh, spaghetti squash and that one was an organic one and I think she said if I remember correctly Trader Joe's so I'll have one two three four five and if this one makes it six and we'll see what else happens and then my potatoes are still going the Clorox soiled potatoes are still at it they're doing big and they're doing much better than the ones that I planted at the same time um, out front they're half the size out front so they're doing good and this little garden back here I ignore because I just don't even come back here I will eventually once uh, the yard gets cleaned up but I just haven't had time so that's a little update on the spaghetti squash from the seeds from the grocery store so have a good day everybody and I hope that you try and grow something just from the seeds from the grocery store too and put it in a little greenhouse keep these on hand and it's actually kind of exciting to see that you can do this so happy planting